Hole, pedals, guitar tabs, and guitar lesson. I'll play all the different parts right at the beginning here. After that, I'll go back through, give a full explanation. Please hit the subscription button. It's the best way of letting me know you like this video and want to see more whole lessons. And now, let's get on into it. So standard tuning here, and this is a lot of fun chord voicings here. Um, started off with this back and forth between a C major 7 to E minor, and that's basically just kind of making the C chord, but just leaving off that, that one on the B. So we just have the 3A, 2 on the D, and then an open G, B, E. And it's just kind of a loose shuffling strum, like, you know, kind of hit the bass notes of it, and then just kind of shuffle through it a little more. Just kind of a loose arbitrary strum and then we just go to an E minor so open low E two on the A and D with the open GBE pretty much the GBE you're just gonna stay open for every chord on this so it's kind of a uh, you know a little trick you can just remember there All right, and we just jump between those two chords in the intro uh, kind of carry that into the verse just that back and forth C major 7 to E minor um, do it a handful of times and then for the verses basically we just end it by switching to a a sus2 which is more like uh you know open a two on the the d you can add that two on the g if you like sounds good and uh open b and e all right and you just carry that through a couple measures uh, for the chorus this will be kind of a uh conglomerate you know putting together of the two guitars what they're doing one guitar is just kind of hitting the power chords and the other guitar is doing more of like an arpeggio with those open e b and g strings um so it's up to you you can like mix them together like this or you know separate them between two guitars uh, it starts with a a so a power chord and then when we add that open e b and g with it, it makes it like a seven sus two so basically you want to hit the power chord and then pick up through that E, B, G, open. All right, then we just move to a C major seven shape, which is basically like the C power chord, the three A, five on the D. And then pick up that E, B, G, open. Move to the E minor shape, so open E power chord here. Pick our E, B, G, and you wanna do that one twice. Alright, and basically we just repeat it again uh, for the chorus. Just go through that A7 sus2, C major 7, E minor twice, and uh, just carry that throughout the chorus. Bridge comes along, everything gets a bit, you know, more distorted, kind of more gain on it, heavier. And it switches more to like a big uh, power chord style here where we want really want to emphasize the power chord. So just hit the big E minor power chord here. And then you can throw in kind of a subtle little just strum there of the open GBE. And then just bounce it to the, the A power chord to set low here. All right, and we just toggle between that E minor to A just like that. All right, 
right? And do that, you know, uh, three times, and then we'll move into uh, kind of this assortment of chords now, which is like a C major seven, our same one from the verse. Feels a lot just like the verse, back to the E minor. C major seven, E minor. Now we add a new little wrinkle here where we throw in this F chord. And it's basically just the F power chord, the one on the E with the three A. And then of course we hit our open uh, G, B, E under it. Technically it's like a F major seven sus two or whatever, but nothing too crazy here. Just right. And then bounce that to the A. To our C major seven, E minor, do the F major seven again, A, do the A once more, and then we do the F major seven twice, and then finish on the A seven sus two.